trying to do is be the best, follow the rules, and make sure that the world sees us as the leader we intend to be. The most regrettable feeling in 10 years would be to reflect back and say, we were in a great spot, but we moved too slowly. We were too cautious. We sought to maximize the minute rather than to own the hour. The, just the notion of being first is an obsession in that if you want to lead, it often doesn't come by being second. So we became the first to trade on the TSX Venture. And we became the first to move up the TSX, the first to be in the Composite Index, the first to raise 100 million, the first to raise 200 million. We became the first to do a consolidating transaction to buy a licensed producer, and then we kept buying them. We're doing a good job of going to where the puck will be. We started off with a really large growing platform, and we diversified rapidly from indoor to indoor and greenhouse. The laughing stock question is, what are you gonna do with all that space? The question today is how do you get more? If Canopy wants to be only one thing, that would be probably a short-term plan. But the regulations requ require us to have multiple businesses in one. So we have to have a very effective agribusiness producing. We have to have a very effective technical skill set, which is extraction. Canopy Rivers assist entities who are in a licensing process or have a license they want to expand to do so more rapidly with capital and certainty that they have the best practices in the sector which come from Canopy. If you allow a continuous flow of increased quantities and uh, types of cannabis to be available to us without having to deploy our capital to own 100%, then we have to have a very effective research capability, which is Canopy Health. Canopy Health's purpose is to take what are formalized ingredients and convert them into testable products that will become either over-the-counter products, a natural health product, or and a drug identification number completed product. And as it becomes global, you start to think about uh, how can I actually take the inventions that occur in Canada and use that knowledge to create value in each geography, and these things kind of become like a really interesting a uh, set of gears running together. Chile and Canada have a terrific relationship. We've set up a joint partnership there where we pick the, what we feel after seeing many parties, the best relationship we could have so that we can begin to do what we've done in Canada. Smaller market, different mix of products, but looking for medical efficacy and management of the cannabis production and delivery. We move over to a place like Brazil. Starting a joint venture business in Brazil takes quite a lot of lawyers and is difficult. You need to have a strong local partner you can't enter. But once you get through it, you end up with the ability to do both research, product importation, and product growth and production. So when you swing to Australia, uh, we've been a participant in the market uh, through a party that looked at all the LPs in Canada and said, we think Tweed Canopy is the best one. We'd like to give them 10% of our company if they'll give us advice and sit on our board. So with OzCam, we became a participant. Germany has been a priority for us. We've been working with the German Opportunity for about two years now. And the effect of that is that we became the first uh, country in North America and second in the world to be asked and permitted to uh, import cannabis to Germany. We have licenses to hold cannabis and distribute cannabis. We have a GMP certified facility on that side of the ocean. And we got the Germans to review and certify our facilities here. Now from a company's perspective, it's really important that we don't want to be the best business case ever of a company that had 40% market share for a week and then runs out forever. And so we've really been focused on spending a lot of shareholder money to build a much bigger production asset, to make a much bigger extraction asset, to create new formulations and products that we think will either be permitted day one or there shortly thereafter. Second half of 2017 calendar is about using those assets to sell quite a lot of cannabis, test and stress, be ready for the first half of calendar 2018. And you know the back half of calendar 2018 is deliver, deliver, deliver. The way Canopy has been formed, the way that we're operating it, it's that we can keep having AGMs. And we can keep having AGMs I want to go to. 
we're not proud just to be leading the company that you're a shareholder in, that Canadians are proud of the company that actually is the leader around the globe. And so the point of the company is that. It is not a quick turn, it's not a hype, it's not a trade, it's to build a great company. And I think we've had that from day one and you're seeing it expressed more and more every day the way we operate.